Hello everyone and welcome back to another Vintage Story tutorial video. Today I would like to introduce you to a function that hardly anyone knows in Vintage Story but which is quite full useful. And you can see which one it is right after the intro. The function I want to show you today is the macro manager. And yes, Vintage Story has a macro manager. And oddly enough, many people don't know that. And what you can do with the macro manager, I want to show you now. So it won't take long, but it's really nice to know. You open the macro manager by pressing the control key and the M key on your keyboard. M like Mike. The macro manager or macro I editor opens, now we move it to the middle of the screen to see what we can do there. Here you have the possibility to put commands behind it. Um, for example, if you play in creative mode and you have to switch from the creative mode to the survival mode, because you want to create a multi-block, because it is not uh, uh, the easy, uh, it's not that easy, you can put it on a certain key combination. If you are not the lucky owner um, of a macro key keyboard like the Logitech G910, uh, for example, you can now be happier, because you can use the macros with a key combination. First, you give the macro a name. Um, well, now take creative in, and then you select a hotkey. So you have to take a certain key combination that you want to assign to the key command. Um, after that, you just have to press the key combination. Now it just take a control alt keypad 6. You should uh, be careful um, not to use uh, Windows hotkeys like Windows and E or Windows and R. Um, all these hotkeys is not possible for the game. Here below you have to enter the command, that is in our case slash game mode creative, and then press save, after that an item appears. And if we want to switch back to survival mode, we add a new macro, we call it survival, after that we assign a key combination again, and uh, in this case we use control of numpad 5. And then we enter again, slash uh, game mode survival, then press save again, and you get a random icon again, and then we can go out of the macro manager again, <laughs> and, and if you just press your key combination, control, alt, numpad 6, then you uh, get into the creative mode, the console will open and you can see that the command has been executed, um, it, it, it works. And are you now in the creative mode? And if you want to go back to the survival mode, then press the key combination you created. Control Alt Numpad 5 and you are now in survival mode. So you have the possibility to put every possible command in a macro. For example, you can also put your emotes on a macro. If I type uh, slash emote wave now, he waves. And of course, we can abbreviate this by using a macro. We go back to a free slot and enter in German, we are nennen es Winken, as the name assign a new key combination, for example, control alt number 8, and then we are entered command again, slash emote wave, after that save again and now you can execute your new macro by pressing Ctrl and Alt and Numpad 8. You will then be able to execute commands very quickly. Of course, there is also much wide range of commands you can use in the game Printed Story. 
if you have any question write them in the comments if you have subscribed yet um, you can do, uh, you can <laughs> do so now uh, if you like the tutorial you can leave me a thumbs up and you can also visit us on a discord server the link is in the video description below thanks for watching macht's gut bis dahin und bleibt so schön